Well, it's official after Friday Night Smackdown's main event of the Gauntlet match. Adam Pearce will face Roman Reigns for the Universal title at Royal Rumble. Now, I'm not expecting this to be a masterclass wrestling match, but it was perfect storytelling. Pretty much the entire night was, will Adam Pearce be in a match? Then he is in a match. Roman got him added to the Gauntlet match, and it was Jey Uso and Roman Reigns beating up Nakamura allowing Adam Pearce to get into the ring. They took him down, and of course, they just made him cover Shinsuke Nakamura. Perfect storytelling by WWE. It's genius. Roman Reigns is a bully. Roman Reigns doesn't want to face someone like Kevin Owens or Daniel Bryan. He wants to face someone like Adam Pearce. He does not want competition for his Universal Championship. Now, although the match may not be a five-star classic... Storyline-wise, it's so smart. It really is. It's nothing like Vince and Stone Cold, but it does have that kind of vibe to it where Roman's willing to do whatever it takes. And the fact that he's now with Paul Heyman and he's got Jey Uso with him as well, everything about this whole story is just spot-on perfect. WWE are excelling themselves on Friday nights and Roman Reigns is a massive part of that. And I think... Going into the Rumble to give him a feud like this, I feel like it would have made more sense if Daniel Bryan was the last guy because Daniel Bryan would then have to overcome the Rumble to finally get to Roman Reigns at Mania, possibly. That would have been a bit more fun, maybe. Um, I I don't know. I don't know. Uh, but that may be the only downfall, the only flaw I can find in that whole thing. Although, to be fair, seeing Shinsuke wrestle tonight was perfect. That guy, you forget how good Shinsuke Nakamura is, but I am hyped for Roman vs Adam Pearce. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff, and I'll see you next time. Peace!